Hi, my name is Draven Gallegos and I am taking Intermediate Composition and I am going to be telling you about my reflections over the semester so far. Let's start off with MWA1. For I, I struggle a little bit with this assignment, okay? Because I don't really have any natural experiences or times that I've really been in nature that have really impacted me a lot other than something goofy like the one I told. So like the one I told, like just for a quick summary, is I actually went pinion like hunting with my family when I was younger and I was like kind of on my own trying to pick up the pinion because I was so excited. And if you don't know what a pinion is, it's just like a little nut is all it is. And they're like my favorite little snack around winter time and stuff. And so I'm all looking for these little pine cones with these nuts. And I like stuck my hand on a tree and I got like all this sap on my hand and I was like, ew. <laughs> I was grabbing like pine cones and stuff and then I felt like a tickle in my hand and I kept like swatting it to like, get it off of my hand. And then I found out it was like this weird like insect with that had like wings. It looked like a spider with wings. And it was like it was like that big from what I remember. And I was like I like screamed at the top of my lungs. My dad was like so freaked out because he thought I hurt myself. I was like, no, I did it. I'm okay. But it was like really scary to me. And like that's like the only like natural experience I've had that's like really impacted me as a person. Um, and it did like really make me think a lot about environmental issues that we deal with today. So I felt like I did struggle a little bit with that assignment, but. I feel like I kind of made it work out by talking about it was called a swamp fly I believe and like they how they like really don't add anything into our environment other than being food for other uh, creatures such as like fish and frogs and things like that so what I think I've learned with the assignments that we have been doing so far in class I think that I've learned how to write towards more academic people and audiences. I mean, I am an art history major and I write a lot of academic articles about art history and arguing about different parts in art history, but not to this extent, like where there's a lot more scientific information that has to be added in. And that's a little challenging for me because it's hard like finding the right articles, making sure that they aren't fake, and just like all this research. And like I said, I'm used to research and stuff like that, but I do most of my research in books. I don't usually go onto today's like kind of websites and things like that just because they aren't reliable towards my degree in study. But definitely writing about nature and ecological crises um, I think I've definitely learned how to find the right articles and how to connect with those type of people more and how to present the information in a more official and professional way. So all together, I feel like with my MWA1, it was kind of a test for me to be able to get into what we are actually going to be talking about in class and how to write those formal academic papers for those intended audiences. Um, I'm excited to learn more about how to do that and f being able now to find the correct resources in order to write those papers will be very helpful, especially towards my academic uh, pursuings, even if it has nothing to do with nature. Um, it definitely, the path that I want to go down into is definitely more science based so finding the right and correct science articles and knowing that they are reliable as sources and as other people's words that are true and not going to mislead anyone uh, I definitely think that that will help me and I'm sure in this class we will learn more about it so yeah that's what I have right now and I can't wait to learn more this semester and I will see y'all later